how to use line 2D node in Godot. It's a very simple node that lets us draw a path and that path will be created from a several points connected by segments. For now, let's delete the example that I have on the screen and we'll create a line 2D node together. Click on the plus icon and type line 2D. And to start drawing, simply click on the screen. That will be the start of your line. And you can keep clicking on the screen to create more points until you create a line or a path that satisfies you. And that's the very basic idea of the line 2D. But there's more you can do with it. So let's focus on the inspector of this line 2D node. Here on the right side, I'm going to show you the things that I use the most often with the line 2D. So let's start from the top. We've got a checkbox to close it. And that will connect the last point with the first one. It creates some sort of shape, but be aware that it's still a line. And it won't be that easy to fill this whole shape, because for that we should use something called polygon 2 d node. More on that in the future. For now, let's uncheck the box. We've got the width, that's the width of the line, so let's make it 30. It's way too much, so 20. The width curve, click on it and add a new curve. And one more time. Here is the graph that will represent the width. So make two points or even three and check how the width of the line changes as I move the graph. You see that the, in the middle of our line, we've got a very narrow width. You can adjust it to your needs. Below we've got a color. It's very basic. So click on it and change the color, fill the gradient. But before that, let's restore the default color. Click to create a new gradient, click on it one more time, and here change the color. We can add another color in the middle, make it green, nice. If you've got the texture, you can drop it here. And also something interesting is here, in the capping, you can change the joint mode. Take a look at the current joints, because they are very sharp right now. The higher the angle, the more visible change it will be. So from sharp, you can make it round. And notice how the joints or the corners are now very smooth and round. Also be well, it is visible here that the corners looks like they were cut. But the round is good for me. I hope you learned something new today. And I encourage you to click on the next video to keep learning more about Godot. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Bye!